We start by casting on 3 to 5 stitches for the eye cord. I'm going to use the knitted cast on method, but the cable cast on works just as well. Insert the tip of the right needle from left to right into the fourth stitch on the left needle. And if you prefer to hold yarn in your right hand, then wrap the needle with the yarn like this. Pull the wrap through, but don't slip the stitch off the left needle. Instead, place the new stitch onto the left needle. We just cast on the first stitch of the eye cord. If you prefer to hold yarn in your left hand, then you will wrap the tip of the needle like this and make another stitch and add it to the needle. I'm going to make an eye cord on three stitches, so this is going to be the last stitch that I will cast on. Now we knit all stitches until we get to the last stitch of the eye cord. In my case, I'm going to knit two stitches and stop when I get to the third stitch of my eye cord. And then we insert the tip of the right needle from right to left into the next two stitches. That's going to be the stitch of the eye cord and the stitch of the main fabric. And knit them together through the back loop like this. Now we have three stitches on the right needle and we're going to slip them one by one back to the left needle. And repeat the process. Knit to the last stitch of the eye cord, then knit the next two stitches together through the back loop. And finally return the stitches of the eye cord to the left needle. And keep going until you have just the stitches of the eye cord sitting on the right needle. And once you have just the stitches of the eye cord on your right needle, cut the yarn leaving a small tail, thread this tail into a wool needle, and run the wool needle through the remaining stitches. Just like this. Slip the stitch from the knitting needle to the wool needle. Then pull the yarn, secure it, and hide the tail inside the eye cord. As you see, the edge is now decorated by a beautiful eye cord that is identical to the eye cord formed by the eye cord cast on method. To learn about other pairs of matching cast on and bind off methods, go to tendrosday.com slash matching dash cast ons dash bind offs. Happy knitting, my friend. I'll talk to you in the next tutorial.